Hello and welcome to another set of readings from Lotus Love Tarot 555. Okay, you guys, I'm here to do your Mercury Retrograde Survival <laughs> Reading, I call this. Um, we know Mercury Retrograde is coming up. It will begin February 17th, okay, and it lasts, I think, all the way through March 10th, if I'm not mistaken. Anyway, we got the correct dates on the flyer, but I believe it's March 10th. Um, that's a, quite a long time, so let me go ahead and encourage you, back up your computer system, at the last Mercury retrograde, my computer actually crashed. So I am a witness to back everything up. And thank God I had everything backed up. Um, but I want to thank you once again, as I do in all of our, our information um, information prior to our readings. And saying thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all your love and support that you continue to give this channel. A little bit about this reading. Once again, it's Mercury retrograde um, survival readings. Um, this is just to give you an idea where you need to plant yourself for the next, you know, uh, several weeks that's ahead of us. Um, you guys, if you are a member of our Patreon, uh, do know that you'll get access to all of the extended versions for Mercury Retrograde. These are bonus readings for our Patreon members. So let me just stress that. Some of you got a little upset about the uh, Happy uh, Valentine's Day uh, readings that I did for our Patreon members. Remember, there are bonuses when you are a part of us, okay? Now, if you want the extended version, we will have access to that for you for $11.11. .11. Okay, and information pertaining to that can be found below. Now, a little bit about this reading. You can apply this to your sun, your moon, your rising, for some, even your Venus and your Jupiter sign. Okay, remember that the messages will flip-flop, so if it doesn't relate to you, it could relate to your partner. Some of the information in here, it may have happened three months ago, may have happened today, may be happening in the near future. But this is more, we're trying to center it around what's happening during this Mercury retrograde period and how you need to uh, really, you know, what areas you really need to hone in on, okay? Um, I think I've covered everything. We've already pre-shuffled. Um, I talk, talked about the time, and I'll make sure I've covered everything in this in these uh, uh, pre-reading uh, talks, as I call them, okay? Like I said before, you guys, all the information is below. Do know I love you, love you, love you, love you so, so much. Oh, Please subscribe to our channel. I knew it was something. Please subscribe to our channel. Hit the like button. And you guys, don't get angry with me because I'm, I'm letting you see the shuffles and everything prior to our readings, okay? Do understand. This is a part of wanting to be a part of our Patreon to be able to get all of these extra readings. But we have several readings on our channel for you to enjoy. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Lotus Love Tarot 555 Okay, that's it. Now... On to your reading. Hello, my Leos. Okay, let's get right into your reading, you guys. This is for your Mercury retrograde reading. Um, you guys, I am doing an extended on this. <clears throat> and so if you want all the extendeds, please go and join our Patreon. Uh, that information can be found below. If you just want this version, it will be $11.11. .11, and that information is below as well. But we're going to go ahead and get started. We'll go ahead and do your jumpstart messages so you can at least get an idea of where it's going, okay? All right, so Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe, what messages need to go forth for the sign of Leo as it relates to the Mercury Retrograde for February 2020? What messages need to go forth for the sign of Leah as it relates to the Mercury retrograde? Okay, there it is. Okay, the spirit, divine creator of the universe. What messages need to go forth for the sign of Leo as it relates to the Mercury retrograde for February 2020? What messages need to go forth for the sign of Leah? Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe, what messages need to go forth for the sign of Leo as it relates to the Mercury retrograde for February 2020? Okay. okay. Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe, what messages need to go forth for the sign of Leo 
as it relates to the Mercury retrograde for February 2020. Spirit, the God created the universe. What messages need to go forth for the sign of Leah as it relates to the Mercury retrograde for February 2020? What messages need to go forth? Okay. All right, you guys, let's get your jumpstart messages, see what's happening. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Okay? So let's just. Keep diving a little deeper into this to see where we're going. Alchemy. You have the Midas touch right now, and every project you begin turns to gold. Wow. Okay, that's a good one. That's a good one. Focus upon divine and perfect health. So, maybe you need to be thinking about your health, working out, eating right, making sure you've got all your doctor's appointments in order. Putting the focus right there during this Mercury retrograde time. Business venture. Trust and follow through on a new business idea or career opportunity. Okay, so this kind of is going with this alchemy card here. You know, everything you're touching is going to turn to gold. So this is a great time. This is a great time to look into um, uh, the businesses, you know, business ventures, maybe ideas that you had. This is a great time to look into that, right? The spirit is saying choose a new direction. So whatever you were thinking about before, maybe you need to recenter you are, you know, where your mind is. Okay, so let's just keep talk. Let's just look at this. Um, let's look at some jumps. The um oh, what am I trying to say? Mercury retrograde is getting to me already. Let's pull from this deck, okay? Uh, to begin to clarify what's happening here. And then I'm going to use the Rider weight to clarify this message. I'm going to allow you to see the cards that drop for you, but we're going to be reading them and going a little bit more in depth in our extended. So we can see why are you having to stay optimistic about your love life. We can see that things are going well business-wise. What are you choosing a new direction about? Uh, you're focusing upon divine and perfect health, but more concerned with choosing a new direction and why you're having to stay optimistic about your love life. Okay, Holy Spirit, divine, creator, universal messages need to go forth for the sign of Leo as it relates to the Mercury retrograde for February 2020. Okay, wow. Okay. Okay. Any more messages for the sign of Thea? Okay, these two go here. Okay, so Leo's, I'm going to show you what the cards are. Get your overarching. So let's share with you what the cards are, and then we're going to go into your extended reading where we're going to explain the cards. See if I see any angel codes, I'll bring that for. See what signs are represented. We'll go through all that in your extended, and then we will clarify with the right of weight. Okay. All right. So your first card is the page of pentacles in reverse. The hierophant. Major Arcana there. Queen of Cups. I love these cards. They have such great imagery. Oh, Ten of Cups. Wow. This is the Three of Wands. This is the King of Pentacles in reverse. Then you have the Knight of Wands in reverse. And your overarching energy is the Ace of Swords. Okay. Ace of Swords. Okay. 
So once again, we're going to go through and explain what this means. We're going to um, go more in depth and then we're going to clarify, you know, some of these cards here with the right of weight. All right. Okay, you guys meet me on the other side.